Have you ever wished you could just reach out and press a button on your home screen to trigger an activity in Home Assistant? Well, you can. Hi there, welcome back to Simon Says. My name is Simon, and today I'm gonna to show you how to use widgets on your iPhone. This will allow you to create a widget that you can press and then run a short piece of code in Node-RED in order to trigger an activity in Home Assistant. So we open up our phone, we go into the Home Assistant app, we click on the three lines on the top left hand side and we go to settings and from settings we select companion app. Now we want to go and we want to go a new action and we want to add a new action. So once we've done that, we go and we click into that action and we give it a name. So we're going to call it Open Garage. Next, we're going to go down to the text field and we're going to type in Open Garage there as well. Now you can go and customize the settings within here, customize the look and the feel of the button, give it whatever sort of a logo you want. Once you've done that, you go and you click and hold in the blank space. That will open up that you can create a new widget on your home screen. Scroll down to Home Assistant, select the Open Garage widget and add widget. And there we go. And now what you can do is you can hold and drag, pull it over to whatever screen you want it to appear in. So if we have a look at our node read action here, all we've done is we've created two little nodes here. We've got a events all node, and here we've just called this iOS action, and we've got an event type of iOS.action underscore fired. And that will listen for the event coming from our iPhone. So that will be in listening mode, and all we do is we connect that to a call service node, which is now gonna call our Shelly, which is now gonna trigger the door opener in our garage. So all we do here is we create a switch domain, and we select that to toggle, and we come along here and we select our Shelly one, which is the device that is linked up directly to our garage door opener. And that's how easy it is. All we do is now, we go and we open up our phone, we go to the home page or the widgets page, we click it there and there we go and it opens our garage door. As easy as that.